What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Hanky, and this is my arm workout. My daily arm workout. I survived a stroke at the age of 60, and I've been recovering ever since, waking up from a coma. This is one of my daily exercise routines. It's my hope to showcase how I cope with my discipline and recover. Who do you spot, Kid Ali? So first I start by doing this workout to try getting a, a rowing effect. Like work out the back of my shoulder, the scalpula. I should be rowing. But this has a similar effect. I do 20 of these. I was using 8 pounds of... Oops, I was using 10 pounds of discs for this. Next, I stretch out my left hand. My left hand is the worst from my stroke. It's basically completely tightened. I can't open my hand on my own. So then I interlace my fingers. And I do these passive motions. I can't remember what they're all called. It's like supination, abduction, adduction. This one specifically really stretches out my pack and my shoulder which are super tight. My stroke tightened up all the muscles in my left side, especially my pack. So that one just stretches out the pack. And then I don't know what exactly this one stretches out. I spin it up. But it's like I bring my left arm across my chest and then push it back. This stretch is obviously for my wrist, my left wrist and hand are about completely bound up. I had to figure out how to even interlace my fingers and this is like 
flipping my left wrist up and down, abduction and adduction, or supination, I don't remember exactly. And then I put on my armrest to do some active reflexive movements with my left arm. It was a few years before I got this movement. And this is just moving my left arm in the motions it naturally wants to go in. And it doesn't seem very functional, but it helps me get out of sticky off balance situations, even with this little movement. It helps me get a better, a better hold on my tone patterns. And tone refers to the muscle tightness caused by my spasticity. And next I do curls. I was doing this with 10 pounds of discs on my dumbbell. Now I have 16 pounds, but it's not as good for my form. First I do 20 curls with my thumb out, and then I do 20 with my thumb in. My friend showed me this. If you put your thumb in, I can feel it more in my shoulder. It targets different muscles. So I just do 20 with my thumb in. After I do 20 with my thumb out. Now I'm just tightening up my dumbbell. And I call these stirrups. My trainer first showed me these with a buoy weight in the pool. I do 30 seconds counterclockwise. And then I do 30 seconds clockwise. And clockwise is really the most intense. That's when I really feel the burn. I hope you guys enjoyed my arm workout. If you want me to produce more content covering stroke recovery, my experiences, and my workouts, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe and turn on the notification bell. I'd like to get my story out there because maybe it can help someone. I hope there's no teenagers out there going through what I went through, but maybe there's someone I can help. Comment what you want to hear from me. Do you want more workouts? Or do you want stories? 
I can tell you countless stories. I had amazing dreams in a coma. So let me know what you want. Thanks for watching.